Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. If you can see, there are only two horses in the field. What the heck happened to M Miss Beautiful Penny, you ask? I don't know, it makes me nervous every time, but her favorite place to hang out is behind the barn, where Storm used to hang out. Penny! Penny! Hey, Pen! There she comes. Look at that, you guys. Look at that. Look at my girl coming. And it's lucky she came. I brought her a carrot. She's a little nervous of this girl. I don't know what's going to happen here. That's a girl. A little bit for you. Wait, we can't fight. She's not a fighter. Lover, not a spider. Don't bite. Don't do that. I'm coming around. I'm coming around. I'll meet you guys in the in the room. Oh gosh, I couldn't even break that one. Have you ever actually even ever met a more gentle horse than that? I never should have introduced a carrot to the field. <laughs> that was bad, Laura. Really bad. Sam stocked us up in hay. Hi, ponies. I'm gonna give you guys carrots, but first I have to throw hay because I get nervous. You all make me nervous. Such cute ponies though. Oh, there she is. My pretty Penny. I still can't figure out a name for her, like a real nickname for her. <laughs> all right, well that might not have been that nice, but she's quiet about being mean. <laughs> oh. She's not a pushy horse. None of our horses are actually pushy anymore. I would honestly say that I feel like she's kind of settled in. She's pretty settled in. Like she's resigned herself to the fact that this is her home now. Tomorrow is my big trail ride with a bunch of people. So today I need to work on Penny and make sure she'll go on my trailer. There's a lot of people going. Tabby's like, it's not a big trail ride, it's big to me. It's not a long one, long enough. What'd you forget in the truck? I need wires. Wires? AirPods. Wires, not oh. really AirPods, but like the ones You need headphones, you mean? Yeah. Gotcha. You know when you go on a trail ride and you don't want to be that one that's screaming her head off? I was that one last time. I hate that I do that. But I also know that sometimes on trail rides, it's where I learn my most stuff. It's where I can go long enough to actually perfect stuff. Like in an arena or in a certain area that you're restricted, you can only learn so much. And I find, like I said before, that the only way I actually learn is to be out there and have a long enough opportunity to figure things out. So hopefully it goes well. If I can ride her today, I'm gonna to try riding her again in the so bit. Hot. We need short skin. It's not that hot. But we're going shopping right now out of town actually. So if we get back in time, I will try and ride her again in the bit before we leave. And if not, I am going to practice getting her on the trailer. She is supposed to be a dream to load, but she's never been on a ramp trailer before. She's always been one that you step up on and she's perfect at it. But our ramp trailer, she didn't love. We are able to drop off Jacob's toy. I showed you guys last week that one of the toys I ordered for his birthday showed up suddenly just out of the blue showed up at my house so I took it to Jacob today dropped it off he's excited and now we're gonna go and look at some more saddles at another tax store um, Greenhawk is a little ways from us but today we made the journey to go there and look at more saddles because one thing I learned yesterday in my saddle shopping expedition is that I still have no idea what I'm gonna get Fiona's kind of busy right now there comes a point in your horsey journey where only you can decide certain things and so all I can do is get as much information as I can and try and get the most right saddle for Penny and I. I love those pants on you, Sophie. I, I was like, mm, I don't like I those ones. Yeah, but now I like them. So this is our store. We're at Green Hawks. This is something that we need. Yeah. Gabby wants to shave. She knows. All right, so I want this kind of girth just with these. See how they stay up? Yeah. And it's really useful for tightening the oh, girth. Hello. Yeah. I want it in this brand though. Why can't you get it in that brand? Because I don't like this one. I want this I one. Want this I know first. they make them. Because we also they make them. And then these are really helpful. They are really helpful. I want this skirt. That's a cute one. Because I don't like this part. 
Well, that's what you need. You need a girth of that. You know what this girth I like? Part. My favorite girth is this one right here. This, this one? Nope. This one? Yep. I think you should get Finn one of those. No. I want I like one of these, but I need a clip instead of this. But what do you mean? A clip. So, if you've been watching. Oh, that's perfect. So, these Look. were like a bridal registry. Yeah. Fill them out, bring them back in the store. Okay. And we'll keep them here, and anyone coming shopping for you knows exactly oh. what it is you're looking for. Oh, you're going to keep it here? Yeah. Oh, that's an awesome idea. Thank you so or much. you can take it home and search online and then fax things to us or, or perfect. things to us. Perfect. Thank you so much. You. Okay, so Gabby, you didn't find the girth you wanted? This is for So she's saying that I can make it a holiday wish list, leave it here, and anybody who comes here can... I want this girl. But for Finn, feel it. It's like the neoprene. Okay, so we need a girth. Sophie needs a new girth, basically. So let's get my pen out, and you're gonna write down the girth you want. Gabby is obsessed with this Mondega leather cleaner and conditioner. She uses it every day, and Kaylee has it too. I think I might get some for myself. And who doesn't love a variety of sponges? I like that pink one right there. This one's a girl from this one's a stallion. All right, trying to explain to Sophie the the beauty of saving your money. She's insistent on getting us Schleich today. She wants to know which one do you guys get. You should do an Instagram poll. Which one should she get? They're both geldings, she says. That one's a stallion. Oh, that's a stallion. This is Never get a I stallion. I kind of want the gelding because look how cute he is. Yeah, he is really cute. Let's look and see if they have a Tennessee walking gelding. They gave me this list that I can write all of our wants on it. If there's a light pink lead rope, I'm getting it. Those ones are too tiny down there, though. No, I really want one. So these are on my list of things to get. These are bell boots that won't come off. Sophie, look at these bell boots. What? I need you to get something down for me. Okay, just wait. Let's pick some of these bell boots. Oh, for Finn? No, Finn does not need bell Finn boots. Finn can have shoes then because I want bell boots. No, Finn is not I having... No, ew. Nobody likes, nobody likes bell boots, but I'm going to get these. Please. Yeah, they're nice. I'm so glad we came here. Look at the variety. So the only saddle they have that would suit me is a dressage saddle. Oh my gosh, this, this store is packed with stuff. All right, what's going on over I here? Go up. In the Gabby department. What size are they? I have no clue. All right. They're too tall. They are too tall. Stand up. Well, that's all they have. But they can order. So if those are your boots that you want. They made the t like the foot part smaller. But they, smaller, they but shrink this... down, Gabby. I know, but but still, I don't want to have to work that hard to shrink it down. <laughs> there are no easy things in life. And, and um, my other ones didn't shrink down that No, I think they're too big. Look at how wide they are. Those are not like a standard. Yeah, they're too big. They're too big. Half. So, but it's a size nine you need though? No. I don't know. Do Probably they fit? Eight and a half. Okay. So look at these, Gabby. Gabby, look at these. I say we get them. No. Don't you want these? These will stay no. on our horses. They won't ever come off. They just, I know, you can use the ones that you have over top of these ones. No. Rubber stretches out over time, too. But people are saying that these won't come off. Rubber stretches out over time. I need to bring Brooklyn here and let her pick what she wants. Cross this off my Christmas list. Cross it off your Christmas list? I actually was looking at this online. I put it on my Christmas list. So now, because there's like different Western sets, so you wouldn't know what one to get me, but I can get it. So I've done a lot of research this year, this winter, and I want Sophie and I to have riding winter paddock boots. One K, yeah. So if he wants a one K, so we should size that today. So basically, I like these, but they're not warm. Ew. I want winter I ones. I need riding, winter riding, but boots. I want warm ones. I want these. Do you actually want? Yes. Okay, so these. Is that a liner in there, or is that just a packaging? That's a liner. Is it? It's styrofoam. Yes, the styrofoam liner. So that it stays up and doesn't crease. So, these are supposed to be winter, I think. 
I really want to try a pair on. One's These ones, ones are better. Ones, you know why those ones are better? Why? Because they don't tie up. You just slip them off. True. And I don't know how to do that. I really like these, though. I want a pair of these. These ones are winter. These ones are not. like a sun shield clicking thing so I'm not a big fan of what's the sun oh for the sun shield mm-hmm okay which I'm not a fan of but not a that fan might... of it either no that shouldn't rub you um my helmet rubs me all right get ready is it rose gold no she doesn't oh that was pretty she doesn't want rose gold put it on like I'm not doing it too small? No, it fits. Uh, it looks too small. So these are all the helmets that they have, and you can see how there are different shapes. Sophie's got a big round head. I think like something like that GPA First Lady. That's a thousand dollars almost. Nope, too small. Yeah, I agree. Sam wants her to get another. Okay. Sam wants her to get a Troxel. Okay. She said no. They officially do not have any any helmets to fit you, Sophie. The 1K does. The 1K fits you? Mm -hmm. Okay, pick both sides. Give a little wiggle this way. And then I want you to very gently just give it a little lift up. It is locked in there. So bring it back down. So you can see that as she's lifting it up, there's that little moment of resistance. Do that again, just gently. Yeah, it's like it's, there's that little lift in that moment of all right. She, so she's, it is. All right, she says it feels good. Yeah. What kind of you got about that is like that long. Too long? How much is that one? And it's like an actual bag. Oh, get me that. Get me two. Hmm? Pass me two. I want to see if there's a shorter one. I mean, whenever we find a black bat, we get it. And you know what else we need today is a good pitchfork. And actually, that's... Well, those aren't the ones I like. So get, Gabby's getting some hoof polish. What's that red thing? Hmm? What's the red thing? The brush. Oh, that's super cool. Just wait, can you help me get a pitchfork? Is this the one that I like right here, this black thing? That's your normal one. All right, that's what I want then. I'm getting it because we are, our pitchforks keep breaking and it's just driving me insane. I feel like that's like, like Sophie's. See, it's plastic. Different kind of plastic than mine. Peanut Sophie's, butter or banana? Sophie's getting ice cream for her puppy. Better? All right. Peanut butter? Should I get bl is black the same as red? What do you mean the same? Are they exactly the same? All right, that's fine. I'll get a black one. How much are they? All right, get both, red and a black, because we need them. I have a really good jump on my Christmas list, like all the things that I know that the girls need like boots and helmets I was able to get fit for them so that I can just come back when I want to without the girls and pick out what I want for Christmas so it's kind of a surprise they don't get to see what I'm buying this is the yeah, dog section oh those are cool but my dog can't eat them yeah your dog can't oh it's annoying I want to get two of these we never tried their but food to see much. if they have a food that's good for Dalmatians Cause like there's Dalmatian photos. Is there? <gasps> Wait. Oh my gosh, look. Oh, I thought that was the food. Look and see what that food is. Salmon recipe, that's not good for her. My favorite section is the toy section. I mean, what do we need toys for when Molly has a pylon? Oh, look at the little unicorn. Yeah. There's also this thing. Oh, I like it. All of our white stuff are black now. I also really love the shed row dog blankets. Dog coats. Like I like those ones right there. They're adorable. That's cute. I like these softer ones. They're really cute. Alright, so Sophie's got her stuff. I've got my stash over there. This is just stuff we're buying today. The rest is going on our Christmas list. So what are you looking for? Oh, so this is something big. This is a Christmas present. 
I'm Another getting one. it now. <laughs> oh, good call. Another one. I need one. I need one that says Penny. Oh, yeah. You want one? I, I do want one. Want one. Stella. So pick one. Okay. A different color there. Oh, I do want one that says Stella. Yeah, I have a bracelet fit, though. No, Sabrina. So okay. super cute. And Sophie doesn't have one either. Or Mom. Mom just get a keychain. Oh, Sophie, don't lean on Mom, me. Mom, just get a keychain. Oh, I could get a keychain. Because I don't usually wear bracelets, but maybe I would wear it. Like every time, I don't know. So you guys know the bracelets that we bought in the past. You get them at Green Hall. All right, so take a look at these. We recommend Roman and Optima. Those are the two that print the clearest, the boldest, the most What do you guys think? I really want to buy a lead rope. I have not bought a single thing for my mare. I like the halter that she has right now. But they do have a pink one here. It's kind of cute. So I could do that. But there's no nice pink lead ropes. I like the ginormous clips on them. I just like a regular clip. Do you think that that one, I mean, it's a pony lead rope. Do you think it would work for Penny? Sam wants this for his truck. And I said I'd buy it for him. And he said he won't put it on his truck. Horse show dad. I just hold the horse and hand over the money. Yeah, well, well, kind of. It is do. kind of what he does. He the horse though. Mom gives the money. Yeah, mom We're gives the money. Your husband called and said for you to buy all the tack or to buy the tack. <laughs> that's a good. That's a good one. Why wouldn't you put that on your? Why wouldn't you put that on your? So you guys have heard me complaining about my reins on my bitless bridle. I don't like how wide they are, and I don't like how flimsy they are. I don't like that it has this big huge clip like this. You know, when you hold it on the buckle, it always tangles in her hair. It's just like, they're too long. It's a mess. Um, but her mane's long. Yeah. If you cut her mane... And the easy thing here is that I have a black bitless bridle. So, what do you guys like? Do you like I to braid it? Why do we get like the really wide ones of these? I don't know. These are thinner? Yeah. No, they're wide. No, they're thinner though. Do you like the braided or do you like plain black? I like the plain um, black. I like the ones that have like this. See. Should I try new reins? No, my reins are fine. <laughs> my reins are fine. We uh, did so much shopping. We didn't buy as much as we shopped for. They, When we walked in the door, they gave us a Christmas wish list and I filled it in and they measured my kids for... John Counter Boulevard. They measured my kids for helmets and boots and everything they need. Okay. Yeah, so that is like a load off. So now I can go back or order online or do whatever I want to do that the girls won't be with me. So Sophie bought herself this gorgeous Tennessee walking mare and she says it looks exactly like the horse in her dream. So maybe you dreamed that you got this horse. Continue. No, but it was real horse size. Yeah, she's really cute. It's a Tennessee walking horse. Okay, so um, Sam bought us all the presents for Christmas. And we're not going to have them until Christmas, so I'm going to show them to you guys. What? <laughs> I'm going to show them. So, because we had to pick them out. Um, and they're really cute. So, Sophie got this bracelet. So many of you guys ask us, where did you get your bracelet? We get them from, uh, from Greenhawk. And her says special. Her says special FX. That's thin. Gabby got a gorgeous leather one. This is the kind that she likes, just plain brown. And it says Cappuccino Minute. She has a stormy night already. Are you going to like switch them up or are you going to wear two, Gabby? Two. And I got this one. Let's see. It says Penny Lane. That's her name, you guys. I decided. I just like it. I like the song. I like the name Penny Lane. When I saw it, it gave me goosebumps. So I feel like that's a good name for her, Penny Lane. And it's just a keychain. I use a keychain every single day with my keys. And so I know that I'll use this. It's leather. It says Pe Penny Lane. The girls were really upset. They thought that I should get one that said Stella Bell. And we did try and put two things on it. So here's the one that says Stella Bell. I could probably put this on something else. It is sad. Like, I was torn on who I should get it for. But I ended up getting it for her. Because I also have on my keychain currently, I have this little Stella heart. It says Stella on it. So I'll just switch it over and I'll put it on my new keychain at Christmas time when I get it. 
so it'll say Penny Lane and it'll say Stella on it. Also, people always ask me how much are those bracelets. They're not very expensive. My keychain was like $14.99 or $11.49. And and like, the bracelets alone were $17.99 and then the thing was like $11.99. Oh, so it's not that cheap. It's expensive. Yeah, so $17.99 for the bracelet and then $11.99 for the tag thing. But what I bought was a new pitchfork and it turns out that it's not very good quality but I need another pitchfork so I just grabbed it while we were there. One thing about Greenhawk is they have really good prices. It's one of the reasons I like to go there for incidental stuff. So I also got two black bats. We always are losing these. We always need them. These are the only ones that are show legal. These are the ones we have to use in a show. So we decided, so I decided like they were only $9.99. You guys saw recently I bought one at the other store. It was $39. $29.99 so I got two of those and then for myself I got a lead rope so it's not the color that I wanted I want light pink for her I like the light pink like my halter um but this has got kind of pink and white and black in it and I don't really like the big clip that they have but I've looked everywhere at all of our tech stuff stores for a lead rope that I would like for her and I can't find one but I bit the biscuit you guys I have a hard time buying stuff for myself and so this is her new lead rope for our trail rides tomorrow. Okay, so I got this western set. Um, it has a Tennessee walking horse in it. Um, I got this peanut butter flavored dog ice cream. Uh, I'm trying it too. So her puppy can eat it. We looked at all the ingredients. There's only like five. always ask me do you guys play with Schleich still? So if he still loves her Schleich. Gabby loves her Schleich but she doesn't really play with it. Alright Gabby what'd you get? I got the hook oil brush with the cap and black hook oil. Mine was doing the trick. Yeah. That's it? Yeah. I also wanted to show you that we saw these in the store. The Jumper Hunter and incurably equestrian t-shirts from Halter Equestrian. If you have been oogling our Halter Equestrian t-shirts, you can now get them at Greenhawk. Isn't that crazy? We saw them there up on the stand and it was, a, it was an amazing moment to see them up there. Penny is the boss, but she's like a gentle boss. I know, I love her. I love you, Pen. I love you. You're such a cutie patootie. All right, I'm gonna, I got my new rope. Looks okay. One day these, oh dear, you better get your butts away. Ruby. One day, Ruby, Molly. Come on. one Molly. day these, these, not all you guys, no, no, no. Molly. Ruby. One day these dogs are gonna get killed if they don't stop. Sometimes she walks away for a minute. And then she has to regain herself and come back. See, here she comes. Oh, good Sophie! Our first disaster! Sophie left the door open. <laughs> My horse! Okay, bring your horse out to her herself. <laughs> Oh, if Gabby was here, she'd be screaming at us. Penny, you did a bad thing. I'm actually so surprised that happened. If you missed it. I was chasing after Gracie and Penny's like, oh, I went like this. And, and Penny's like, crap, there's something there. Be careful. She gets scared. It's, it is good for her to have kids running around and making noises so that she gets used to it. But she doesn't like it. You're just going to get used she to us like still. Fast okay, so... Yeah, because she's probably had some fast-moving bad experiences, but us fast-moving won't be bad. I promise you that. So what happened? Sophie yeah. got, Sophie let the ponies in, and Gracie made a run for it. Yeah, because she found there's no food in there, so she made a run for it in there. Went into the tack room, and, and the then and the door was open, so I was waiting for Penny to walk up to me because she always walks up to me, and all of a sudden she just bypasses me and runs through the door, and she went in that stall. And then she spooks because I went like this. Did you? She's like, crap, there's someone there, I can't do that. All right, well anyway, we're gonna go and, for a little like, ride. You know, she doesn't run people we're gonna go for a little ride and then try and see if we can get you up on the trailer, okay? Without Gabby, I without Sam. Your ears at me. Just Sophie and I. 
Before I even got Penny, I swear, I told you guys that I felt like Sophie would probably be my partner in crime when it came to the whole gated experience. And she really loves it. Okay, I just need my brown white paint mare and then we can go on trails. Yeah. And uh, Gabby doesn't love it and that's okay. It's totally okay. She supports me. She knows that this is what I want and she's okay with it. Willipede. If you smell apples, Willipede. So I'm still on my journey to find my saddle. If you look up 20 or 10 best saddles for a gated horse, uh, this one is down there on the list. This is actually like considered top 10 good for a gated horse because it's not very far forward here and it's pretty small skirted. It's a small saddle and normally gated horses are small backed so I think that's why it fell on the list. Like it's short not small. Yeah. All right are we ready to roll? Yeah she's still chewing her. Okay so um, I know I'm good to ride in it for right now while I look. I definitely want something better for me. I want a like nice big huge 18 inch saddle but you just can't get them. You need to teach her to put her head down while you're riding. Yeah, so I also want to teach her to put her head down when I'm riding. Jump into the car on a Friday night. I want to drive with you. Looking for a bar in the nearest town. I've never seen a sky so blue. We don't ever play it in the night. It's young. It doesn't matter what we do. There ain't nobody like So beautiful, and I'm so lucky to be yours. And you're taking me high. Ain't nobody like you. I'm not coming down. Ain't nobody like you. I could go a thousand miles as long as I'm with you. Yeah, you're taking me high. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody like you. She looks kind of off in one end, on one foot. I don't know. I don't know if she does. I'm gonna get Gabby to look at the footage, but honestly, today is a whole different horse. I have Molly, get. 
I have brakes. I had brakes yeah, for the first time. I'm not holding her that much. Yeah, but I had to what learn it. What you need to work on is putting your head, hands forward. When I feel like my hands are forward, they're not forward. But I wasn't pulling. Like, I feel like I have to have your a little bit of contact. Right here. Oh. Your hands need to be up here. Yeah, it's a hard thing for me. But I wasn't pulling, so that's that's a big thing. Like, she did so good. I want her to eat grass, but she can't with this bit. That's a part of the problem with the bit. Good girl, though. Like, I can't tell you. I hope she's not lame. I hope she's not sore. I, you never know what she could happen. Just be, like, Look at the sunset. This is what we were riding into. Oh, you can't even tell. Like, it is... It's so red. Like, there's just so much red. One thing, I don't know if you guys can see it, it's kind of dark. I need to start riding her in the afternoon, which I will. But the big thing for me in this lesson is that she listens so well off my leg. You guys saw there's a couple of spots. Oh, bite it. You guys saw that there's a couple of spots in the arena that are spooky for her. It was dark, like a little bit dark. And she tried to get away from it. But when I do push her over, she does go over. At one point, she put her head down. And I was so excited. Sophie said it was because she's pooping. Took away all my joy. She listened to me. So I've been watching a million videos today on how to stop a horse, a fast horse, and a young horse. And like just watching all the videos. And they said like to, if you tighten your tummy muscles, it makes you sit back. And it kind of makes you like relax a little. And then she should stop instant. She stopped instant. I did a little bit of half halting. Sophie says, like, when I'm holding the reins, it doesn't feel like they're tight. Sophie says it looks like they're tight, but it doesn't, like, I wasn't, didn't feel like I was pulling on her, and she wasn't reacting like I was pulling on her. I always want to have a little bit of contact, I feel like. I don't know. I don't know what's right yet, but I feel like I'm ready for Brandon, and I feel like I'm ready for my trail ride. We'll see you guys tomorrow during the trail ride, as long as she's okay. I gotta get Gabby to check her and make sure. I'll maybe send a video to Brandon or Fiona and see if she looks off. Don't you know that you're beautiful?